Hey folks, Mark here at RC Planes, Copters, and Trucks. Well, we're looking uh, right there at the new uh, OMP, which stands for Ohio Model Products. It's the OMP M2 Evo. Uh, yes, clutch pitch helicopter, about 200 size. Now, just for comparison, you can see back here we got the V950 uh, WL Toys. V950, yeah, V950 right there. And then here we've got the the M2, the OMP M2 Evo uh, RTF, and there's the Radio Master Radio that comes with it. So they're about the same size, the uh, yellow uh, M2 and the uh, orange V950. Now the V950 is very basic; it's a fantastic helicopter, for, especially for uh, experienced beginners or, or intermediate flyers, in my opinion. Um, but the uh, V950, for example, has a brushless main rotor motor, uh, brushed tail rotor. Uh, the V950 also has one head speed only when you're in clutch, when you're flying clutch of pitch. Uh, yeah, it's got one head speed only. Um, the M2, however, has the two different head speeds and so on. So, uh, all right, so let's take a look at the helicopter for starters, just up close a little bit. I can't get real close with this video camera right now. It doesn't do close very well. But we'll just take a look at it. It's beautiful. Just beautifully made. Uh, and designed. Now, uh, this Ohio, Ohio, Ohio model products, this helicopter here, the N2 and the others are, it says right in, on their page, on their web page, that uh, all their models are uh, designed and manufactured in the U.S. by OMP Hobby. So yeah, dual brushless motors on this copter, uh, direct drive, and I'm not sure exactly what that means, so I'm going to find out. Uh, yeah. All right, so here's an interesting thing. Here's the Radio Master Radio that comes with it. It's like a gaming controller type of a, you know, looking deal. But I have to say, this radio turns out to be a lot more than I was expecting. Um, and that's, well, so. There we go. So I get my camera. That's kind of stuff. Okay. A lot more than I was expecting. Um, now, first of all, when you buy the RTF, you get this radio, okay? And there's all these. Well, first of all, for a radio like this, look at all the different uh, controls here. We got the where my thumb is. We got system uh, button control. We got uh, return page page. We got uh, here a scrolling button that you also push. Uh, telemetry model. You push this when you go to bind the model. You, do, you have a display screen on here. Okay, you've got your trim switches. All right, and then if you turn this little guy around, you've got audio on here. And then if you turn this around to the back, actually, let's do a better view. This might be a better view like this. There you go. On the top, uh, on the top, we've got, and I hope we're in focus, we've got a switch here, which I found out is throttle cut, and I've got it so marked. We've got a, that's a two way. We've got a three way here, which is unused currently. We've got the uh, two-way here, which is to turn the stabilization on or off. I'm in the stabilization mode here. The level cup mode over here. Now this is my flight mode, <clears throat> meaning idle up one, idle up two. Okay, that's that. And uh, this one here is a three-position switch not used. Now, here's an interesting thing about this radio. Let me put it back here. All right, interesting thing about the little Radio Master radio is that... Uh, if, I'm, if I recall correctly, the description on Amazon said that the radio comes with the batteries for the radio, but it actually does not. And furthermore, I went to, to look at the radio to see if there's a battery compartment. I didn't see one. So uh, I thought that it was all ready to go. I thought that it's got the transmitter set up so you run it off of L ion battery internal, an internal L ion battery. Excuse me, can I start over? Yeah, the transmitter is set up to run off of two L ion batteries that you have to purchase separately. Okay, I didn't know that. You have to purchase them separately. And the reason I couldn't uh, find the battery compartment is that the batteries go here. One battery goes here on the back side. See, one goes here and one goes there on the back side. Um, so, so I uh, ended up not ordering the batteries for this transmitter because I thought it came with them. However, down here, you can see that it will accept. A two-cell external battery. Oh yeah, 
and I just happened to be able to find a little tiny two cell that's one third the uh, normal milliamp hours of a uh, 900 for this transmitter. Uh, but this is a 300 milliamp hour, and uh, I attached this so I can charge it with my little smart uh, charger here. There we go. With this little smart charger, I can now plug this little external battery, temporary, and I got some Velcro on here, so I can just pull this off, and then there's just a little strip of Velcro behind. So I charge this up here with this here, and I plug it in at the dead center screen, plug it in there, and now the transmitter runs off of that little external battery. And, uh, yep. So, uh, let's see. This first one will turn it on. You have to hold it until you start seeing those four squares. There we go. Welcome to HTX. Okay, it's got voice. Oh, See, it's got voice. It's got voice. Like my DX6, okay? See? There you go. Pretty nice little radio. Uh, we'll shut it down. So, yeah, I guess that's about it. Um, it's uh, pretty windy right now. Anyway, that, again, that shows you how that's mounted and that's removable. Um, there's, switch, there's all kinds of stuff on this uh, uh, transmitter. There's a switch here, a switch here, and then all this, uh, a button, uh, those are buttons, and then all the switches here I showed you. So this little transmitter is actually set up pretty good. Uh, it was pretty easy to bind, following the instructions and stuff. Yes, sir. Okay, pretty easy to bind, following the instructions. Um, it comes in this box, which is like a styrofoam, but it's really nice. It's almost got like a tweed look to it. And if you open this up here, the helicopter fits in here super well. Your helicopter, your batteries, spare parts and stuff. So it's really easy to transport the model safely to the field. There's this flush plate leveler. And here are some various parts, spare parts. Oh, I see a spare uh, main rotor shaft or two. Okay, so you got some spare parts in there. So there you go. So this little box is a nice way to uh, receive the model and uh, protect the model. And then, of course, you've got your usual uh, rotor blade uh, holder in place deal. The instruction manual is okay. It's very minimal. you got to fill in the blanks yourself. Um, let's open this to the beginning anyway. Uh, yeah, so, uh, here it shows you on the uh, center screen, it shows you the uh, different, what the controls are. This down here explains that you need batteries that are not uh, included and what type of batteries they are, which is that you need two 3.7 volt 18350 lithium ion, excuse me. No, excuse me. Yeah, yeah, the battery that you, uh, the batteries that you want to buy separately to put in the transmitter and a radio, what do you want? Radio master, they uh, yeah, sell their own too. Also, before I forget, if you buy this M2 RTF from Amazon like I did, 450 bucks. If you buy this same model M2 RTF directly from OMP, it's 400. You save 50 dollars by buying this RTF directly from OMP, and plus you support them. Anyway, so there's all the stuff about binding and whatnot. Um, yeah, and again, it tells you exactly what type of battery it is that you need and all the specs for it and so on and so forth. Yes. Okay, so that's it. Um, yeah, I think that is it. Anything else in here that we need to know? That's about it. That's about it. All right, so thanks for watching. Thanks for subbing. Uh, this is my new channel. I, it was originally at RC. Let's see what goes at. Copters, crawlers, and planes, RC. And then uh, RC uh, Aviation and Motorsports. I lost access to that, so now we've got this new channel. Uh, RC planes, copters, and trucks. Okay. Going to do the Maiden soon. Too windy right now, but uh, tune in for the Maiden if you want to. And I hope you do. Thanks. Mark, signing off right now.